been, uh, been training for about 40 years, 50 years. And we come down here in the, in the winter, and we enjoy it, and we get our horses to try and win, take care of the weather. What was horse racing like, right, me actually, right, 40 years ago? 40 years ago, it's a lot better than it is today. Yeah. Too many people that don't know what they're doing, too many people that want to do things that are not like the old school. The old school is everything. Mm. Throughout the years, right, your favorite moment? Every day is a favorite moment to me. Every day I have horses, I, I, I enjoy it. But my favorite moments when you go to a stake race or you go to a handicap situation or a starter race and you have to prove yourself. And sometimes the horses make a fool out of you, sometimes they make you into a champion. Wow. And yeah. that's about what I feel about this. Yeah. Yeah. You got a favorite horse of all time? Uh, the horse just He's still here right now. His name is Belgrano. Nice horse. Mm. He finished third in the graded stake a couple of weeks ago. He's won startup races, handicap race, a couple of stakes. We claimed him real cheap for about 16000 and he's doing good. Mm -hmm. Those are the kind of horses that you like. And what's your most memorable horse race, man, that you've seen to this day that you still play back, man? Always the greatest race to what I saw. Uh, Stevie Corton and, and Georgie Velasquez in the, the head and head, always at the wire. Three three races, they're right there every time. Wow, that think? was that was the greatest. That's that was a thrill to watch those two riders ride those two horses, Georgie Velasquez and Stevie Corton, all the way around with Secretariat and the other horse, and he was another champion. Ali Dar and uh, yeah, that's the one. Well, and my other thrill is to have uh, Mr. Castillo here. We talk about the old days. <laughs> yeah, yeah.